guys and welcome back to Mika Reacts and Reviews where we react and review to things on the internet same day, same shirt, different video. And today we are going to be reacting to someone that I was suggested to uh, suggested to react to a minute ago called M Mises, Mises and his, his new song Christian. Um, I believe that's how you pronounce all of that. I know that I was suggested to do his like black and white one and I will get to that but since this is one of his newer songs and he just dropped it not too long ago, like a couple of days ago, I thought I would give, let this be my introduction to him and I would do his other song, Shirley, don't worry, they're coming, I have a list. Alright, let's get into it. Wait. Come on guys, hurry up. Alright, mom, we're coming. Alright. He's a daddy. Getting his kids together. Church. Okay. Hey, baby. Look how we look at each other, judging books by that cover. If I yeah, told you I was Christian, how quick you think nice I would transition. judge you? Damn, I'm supposed to be normal, my love, huh? So what's that look like from above, dog? Well, let me go ahead and sit in the seat this high. And tell all you people out there with me, it's not. Nah, okay, that was a little cold. bait and no, switch. I thought like the guy sailor. in the video yeah, was talk the about a fisherman. <laughs> tell me they ain't swear. That's him. Not a legalist. Yeah, I like it. No. I like that. Not a homophobe. Like no. Yeah, I disagree. Right. <laughs> I do. But I ain't throwing stones. I ain't. I ain't holy wrong. Look, I'm well aware I'm flawed. No better than you, just better than who. I used to be back in the day and that's all. No, no MD, no degree, no paper on the wall. Not a doctor, not a scientist. I'm Alright, I liked in the beginning too. I didn't miss it when he said judging a book by a cover if he told you a Christian you wouldn't believe in. I really don't like the fact that and this is one of the reasons why I like I left the church that even though my church was a little more progressive than other churches, but still pretty Christian. Um that is this like image that you have to look like you have to walk and talk and behave and if you don't do those things then you're not a real christian or you're a little christian or you're fifth fence sitting christian which is supposed to be like the worst kinds of christians right like the the lukewarm christians and so like for me like i think that's so stupid because it just runs so many people away from god and from church and stuff like that where if god designed us and created us in his image then who we are is who we are you know what i mean and we can be better people and we can become better people but we don't we don't get birthed out perfect you don't get saved and all of a sudden you're perfect right it's a journey and you learn and and, and, be, and improve as you go and so there's like this sort of this pressure to be perfect right now, right now, um, I think is silly. And I think any, no matter what you look like, you can be Christian or be Catholic, Catholic or Muslim or whatever. But I feel like it's this, this, the religion, the, the, the actual religions or the institutions is what tells you to, you gotta be just like this. And if you're not, then you're not, you're not real. You're not a true Christian or true Catholic or true Muslim on all these things. And I think it's silly. I know. I'm ranting. Let's get back into the video. Just me, that's all. No judge, just a witness that I give it to you raw. Whatever I talk, trust that I walk. That's all that I done. That's all that I saw. No, not a theologian. Nah, not a Bible thumper. Nah, and it don't make me a better driver with a fish on my bumper. <laughs> not a priest, not a pastor, not really so. Exactly, exactly. I'm so sick of this stupid like narrative that like, oh, if you're Christian and you must hate gay people. It's like, no. First of all, homophobe, phobia. It's to be afraid of, to be scared of. Just because you disagree with someone's lifestyle doesn't mean you're afraid of or scared of. So you're using that word wrong, like a lot of people do. But anyway, most Christians don't care. They're just living their life. And your life is your life and your path is your path. And whatever your judgment is, whatever your judgment is, it has nothing to do with me. I personally am no longer, no longer Christian or re religious. I still believe in God. But I don't care. I support the LGBTQ and, and, and trans and all that stuff because I, I don't know that I'm not God. And I'm never going to pretend I'm God's proxy or the mouth of God to tell people like that's a sin or that's wrong. I don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. I don't know. I didn't die. I can't tell you. So like for me, I'm going to accept and love anybody for who they are as long as they're not hurting anybody or oppressing anybody or lying or cheating or with all those things, corruption. But I'm going to accept people for who they are. And that's how I am. But even if you do think it's a sin doesn't mean you hate somebody it doesn't mean you don't think they should have rights it doesn't mean you think they should be harassed it's just your own personal belief man i didn't want to make a long video <laughs> all right we're gonna get back into it 
if I'm preaching But I'm damn sure not the soft type that'll sit back in these bleachers like hey. Fear of rejection is kept my stomach and eyes but not anymore Not sure why I expect accept this like I'm not in a war But you're not my enemy people that's not where the battle starts See we need to treat the heart of the matter cause it's a matter of heart Ugh. Not cliche not saying I have all the answers And hell no I ain't okay with little kids dying from cancer And yeah I cry but don't ask me why if I can't ask you to what now Cause with all due respect definitely catch up to it somehow Like <laughs> step off a ledge right or not You're gonna fall like it or not God doesn't need a permission He is I am and I am I'm not So stop with insanity man cannot be who created the universe Look you don't like how he runs it with well, tough shit Truth hurts. Kinda like being crucified, but hey, it's cool if I spill a lie so that you and I don't feel cause our two views collide. So instead, continue these try dialogues by the blue and sky. What we do, nine to five, till we use all the time signed in a short little few the lives and then die. Can't do it. All this arguing so damn foolish. I don't care what color Jesus was. All I know is that the man's Jewish. All I know is God became man cause man tried to become him. Every race got red blood, that's why it's blood that covers sins. You'll never win with these conversations. Going back and forth about denominations. Nations rise up against nations. Signs of the times got more blatant. Hey man, I'm not the one, I'm not the son, not even close. I don't love idols, I don't love titles, and I ain't bound to no pope. I don't worship jewels, I don't worship jewelry. I worship the rule and he, he, he has a name No level of fame can never top That's why as soon as you sing his praise Dang, your popularity drops ah, It's just a coincidence You don't really know even though it's happened to me I, I'm trying not to stop it Because he's saying a lot of stuff that I already spoke on um, But like the whole race thing I cannot understand for the life of me People who say that they're Christian Or people who say that they're religious Or people who say they're spiritual Care so much about race and care so much about gender and all these other things. It's like, do you really think God is that petty? If we're all created in the image of God, why do you care so much about race? Why? Do you really think when going to heaven is going to be segregated? Do you, do you really think, I mean, if there's a heaven or whatever afterlife is, the fucking, you know, the after, the, the planes, the realities or whatever. When we die and go into the different realities or plane or dimensions or heaven or whatever you believe, on, believe in, do you really think race is going to be a thing? Or do you even think we're going to have race or gender or sexuality? Like, just kills me when people are like, I'm so Christian or I'm so spiritual. I believe so much in God. But they are like, fucking has a hard on about race. And sex and gender and all these labels that you put on yourself is so dumb. I'm I'm not angry. I'm just passionate. <laughs> let's continue. Let's continue. I'm liking what he's spitting. I like this guy a lot. He only has thirty nine thousand views. What the hell? Let's go. Let's go. I hope I'm in focus. Careers in a row, but yo, I leave that alone. I'm gonna put it like this. I ain't in love with the list. I just think that I'd be a little pissed if my kids live like I didn't exist. Feel me? So chill with the boxes that you put me in. Why are you standing on the outside looking in? Look at him. Took his sin and put it all out on display. Why you lock it in a closet acting like your life is gray? Okay. This is me, nothing more, nothing less. Seriously. You say, you, you say anything about God, all of a sudden people are like, oh. That's why they're trying to take the, the Pledge of Allegiance out. They're trying to wait because it says God in there. Not that you have to pledge the United States, but you know. They're like trying to get rid of prayer and government. It's like, why are we so anti-God all of a sudden? It's fine to be anti-church or anti-religion or anti-establishment. But anti-God, why? Um, and the whole thing, like, I don't worship jewelry and all this stuff. Like, yes, this whole idol worshiping. Even people that I respect and admire, like a Tommy Donald. I don't idolize him. I, I admire him, and I, he's ins he inspires me. And that's why I say in my videos, do not idolize him. He is just a human being who's probably going to make a mistake at some point that disappoints you. And that's fine, because we're all humans. But don't idolize people. Be, um, admire them and be inspired by them. This idolization of people and influencers and celebrities or material things I never cared about that stuff even when I was a teenager I just never cared all I wanted to do is be happy whatever made me happy that's the pursuit of life that I was gonna go after or not just like happy as an indulgence but like peace of mind you know what I mean <sighs> I like this guy careers in a row but yo I leave that alone I'm gonna put it like this I ain't in love with the list I just think that I'd be a little pissed if my kids live like I didn't exist feel me so chill with the boxes that you put me in 
Why you standing on the outside looking in? Look at him. What? Took your sin and put it all out on display. Why you lock it in a closet acting like your life is great? Okay. This is me, nothing more, nothing less. Do I love Jesus? Best belief is source. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you put your sins in a closet. This is a whole fucking cancel culture thing. I always said, I wish there was some universal law, not a government law, but a universal law. Like every time you try to cancel somebody, that all your closet, all the skeletons in your closet would just be revealed. That would stop a lot of people from pointing fingers because they don't want their shit to be told. Everybody got shit in the closet. Everybody got things that they're ashamed of. Everybody got stuff that they don't want want out there so stop pointing fingers and judging everybody else when you need to be like looking at your own shit clean your own room before you try to tell other people how to live their lives right and the whole like chill in the box that you put me in yes thank you i hate that shit like oh you're a woman oh you're black oh you're bi or whatever like that that means that you believe in all these things that means these are your beliefs and your ideologies and these are your political stances and all that stuff like chill on that that is so dumb and boring. Think a little bit higher. Raise your level of thinking and consciousness. Come on, people. Nothing more, nothing less. Do I love Jesus? Best belief is source, yes. But am I still a Christian? I ain't sure. Cause if it's everything I just said that I'm not, then not no more. Sorry about that. Um, I ran out of space on my phone, and by the time I uploaded all the projects that I were doing, all the videos I recorded, reacting videos I recorded, by the time they uploaded, the sun was down and it was just too dark to finish out the recording. Um, but anyway, I absolutely loved that song. I regret not actually re reacting to it sooner. Um, I think he deserves so many more views. Um, I really hit home. I related to so much of, of what he was saying. I really like the one line where he says that he he doesn't worship words. And I feel like a lot of people focus so much. And I know the really religious, like really, really dedicated to the Bible and sticking to the word. Um, it's going to disagree with me on it. But there's a lot of people that worship the Bible and they don't like actually have a relationship with God or they don't actually focus on their own character. It's just like they think just because they can memorize the back, the Bible frontward to backwards means that they're a good Christian. And I do believe it says something in scripture. Or at least I was taught in church that the devil even rem like memorizes the Bible. So just because you remember, right, you memorize the Bible and you can pull out scripture doesn't mean that you're you know being what God wants you to be like as you're on this earth and, but who am I to say that you know what I mean I also want to make it really clear that I don't have any issues with the church I think the church is a great uh sanctuary for people who need the church or want to be at a church I think it provides a great community and a fellowship for a lot of people there is some negatives and and some and some corruptions in uh, you know church uh institutions and, but I'm not saying that that's all churches or all places of worship or synagogues or mosques or anything like that. Churches and church groups and church leaders provide a lot of shelter and, and charity and, and they go out of their way to help people with um, their, their mission trips and stuff like that. So like, I don't have a problem with the church. I just believe that the church isn't meant for everyone. That everyone was meant for the church. Not everybody's personality types is meant for the church. And that doesn't mean that they don't have a relationship with God. And it doesn't mean that they're not good people. It's just not for everybody. I really believe that. And I think some people trying to sort of mold themselves into a church would actually hurt their relationships more with God than help. Um, but that's just my belief. That's just my opinion. I really like this song. Guys, tell me what you think think do you like this song do you relate to it do you want me to do more of songs from this artist please like comment and subscribe hit the bell for the notifications when so you can get the notification so you can get notified when i do upload it helps with the algorithm guys and you guys have an amazing an amazing an amazing day thank you bye